Good morning, ladies. It's been a long time since I've been on. I am challenging myself this week to get in a little bit of yoga every single day. Um, believe it or not, even as a yoga teacher um, and being at home with my little one all day, it's really difficult to get in some yoga. So I thought I would start this morning um, with y'all. And uh, if anyone wants to hop on and join, grab your mat. And um, if you didn't catch this live, then I challenge you to um, do this later in the day, um, maybe in the afternoon or evening. Um, but this is a great morning routine. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. <sighs> we're gonna come to our mat and stand with our feet hip width distance apart. <sighs> Take a deep inhale through the nose. Filling up the belly, ribs, and chest, and exhaling out of the mouth. A couple of more deep inhales. When you're ready, inhaling rising and reaching up to the sky, maybe just a little slight back bend here. Inhale, we're gonna tip to the left side. And exhale back to center. Inhale to the right. And exhale back to center. Inhale, we're going to hug and twist towards the left. Inhale, rise and reach and twist towards the right. Give ourselves a little bit of a hug. Inhale, back to center. We're going to do that again. Tip over to the left. Inhaling and exhaling back to center. Inhaling over to the right. And exhaling back to center. Inhaling, twisting towards the left. Slight little hug here. And inhale back to center. Exhale towards the left. I'm sorry, towards the right. Nice little hug. Inhale, coming back to center. Maybe pushing the hips forward just a little bit. Slight back bend. And then exhale, we're going to fold at the hip crease all the way down towards the mat for forward bend. Just allowing the head and neck to fall where they may, maybe shaking the head no. If you um, aren't able to reach the floor, that's no problem. You can always bring the floor up to you, reaching for a block or bolster. Inhale, we're going to lift up halfway, shoulders even with the hips. And exhale, we're going to fold. We're going to plant the hands and just come back into um, a tabletop position on all fours. We're going to align our shoulders over our elbows and our wrists and our hips are going to be aligned over our knees. On our next inhale, we're going to allow the belly, ribs, and chest to sink towards the ground. And inhale, looking up. Exhale, we're going to round the back for cat. Inhale, cow pose. Exhale, cat. Inhale, cow pose. On our next, we're going to come back to just an easy tabletop position. And on our inhale, we're going to take our right foot to the back of our mat. Toes are pressed into the mat. We're gonna slowly, slowly rock back and forth, nice and gentle. And if it feels nice, we're gonna inhale, lift our foot even with our hips. So there's a long line from our bottom of our heel all the way to our hips. And if it feels good, taking the opposite hand, reaching out above our mat, inhaling nice and long for spinal balance.
and exhale, releasing back down to the ground. I like to wag the tail here, shaking out the hips back and forth. Inhale, we're going to take that left foot back to the back of the mat. Gently, slowly rocking back and forth. Inhale, lift that hip even with the hip, or lift that foot even with the hips. Bringing our hand out together and inhaling, extending for spinal balance. So we're extending from our fingertips all the way to the back of our heel. Inhaling through the nose, exhaling through the nose with that ujjayi breath. And exhale, release. Coming back down to our mat, shaking out the hips. Next, we're going to tuck the toes and come into downward facing dog. Inhaling into down dog, maybe pedaling out the feet in the back. And then our inhale, we're gonna look in between the hands and slowly step or float to the top of our mat for forward bend. Inhale, halfway lift, shoulders come even with the hips. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, rise and reach to the ceiling, coming up into mountain pose. Maybe pushing the hips forward for a slight back bend. And exhale, we're gonna fold it all the way back down. Inhale, halfway lift, shoulders even with the hips. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, we're gonna rise and reach up to the ceiling. Nice and strong. And exhale, bring those hands to heart center. I'm gonna show you that from the side. So inhale, feet are hip width distance apart, rise and reach towards the ceiling, and exhale, folding at the hips all the way down towards the ground. Inhale, halfway lift, shoulders come even with the hips, and exhale, forward fold. Relaxing the head and neck. Inhale, halfway lift, shoulders even with the hips. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, we're gonna rise and reach up to the ceiling. Maybe push those hips forward for a slight back bend. And exhale, bringing those hands to heart center. Nice job. On our inhale, we're gonna rise and reach. And exhale, we're gonna bring it all the way back down, forward bend. Inhale, halfway lift, shoulders even with the hips. And exhale, if you're at the top of your mat, we're gonna place our hands on our mat, slowly step back into a plank pose. Nice and strong, if you've been doing our plank challenge, this is no problem. And inhale, we're gonna shift forward, Exhale, lower halfway down. Inhale, bringing the chest and heart through for upward facing dog. And exhale, we're gonna take it back into downward facing dog. Inhale, we're gonna slowly look in between the hands. Step or float to the top of our mat. Forward bend. Inhale, halfway lift, shoulders even with the hips. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, we're gonna rise and reach nice and tall. I'm scooting back so you can see me. And exhale, we're gonna sit back down into our imaginary chair. You can bring your hands to heart center. Our hands can be up by the ears. The back is nice and long and extended. All of our weight is in our heels. Inhale, rise and reach. Hands come to heart center. We're gonna focus on a balance pose this morning. This is a short little morning meditation. So we're gonna inhale, taking our weight into our left foot. So bringing this toe up. I was practicing this position yesterday 
sort of fun. Inhale, we're going to raise our knee up, so standing knee raise, placing our hand, our same hand, our left right hand on our right knee, and then inhaling, we're going to bring our knee out to the side, and then extend our arm out. And this is modified hand to the big toe. So you can stay right here. This is a beautiful balancing pose. Or if you'd like to try hand to the big toe without the modification, exhale, release, coming back down to your mat, shaking out your legs. We'll try the non-modified way to do it on the opposite leg. So inhaling, we're gonna take our foot into our right, or take our weight into our right foot. We're gonna bring our knee up, standing knee raise. We're gonna take our peace fingers of our left hand, take them around our left toe. Our arm is on the inside of our knee. We're gonna inhale, we're gonna extend this out and take our other hand out. Nice and strong, breathing. You may have a bend in your knee like I do, or you may have a little bit of topple. Inhale, release, nice and long. Whew. Nice little balance there to warm us up for the day, get us nice and grounded. Do some heel drops. This is just a little morning mashup of yoga. Inhale, we're gonna rise and reach up to the ceiling. And exhale, we're gonna fold it all the way back down. Forward bend. Inhale, halfway lift. And exhale, we're gonna come back down onto our knees. We're gonna take our knees out to the side of our mat, nice and wide, toes together. And exhale, we're gonna come down into child's pose. Now child's pose, may not work for everyone to come all the way down on your knees or hips on your feet. If it does, you can just take your forehead down. But if not, a modification is staying on your forearms and placing your forehead on the block at whatever height you need. Right here, 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 whatever feels good. Inhaling through the nose and releasing breath, exhaling out of the mouth. <sighs> One more deep inhale through the nose and exhale out of the mouth. All right. Well, ladies, thank you so much for joining me this morning. I know that was a short, brief meditation, um, but we did it. I did it. You did it. We can cheer each other on. So if you have any questions, I'll be doing a full version of that class every Friday morning at 9 a.m. in Plano. You can attend in person or via Zoom, so similar to what you're doing here on your phone, or on your computer. Um, if you pay for the class, you also get the recording, um, so you can use that at another time. Um, and I have some exciting things coming up. So I have yoga at the farm in Plano coming up on May 1st, and then on June 5th and June 12th, I have yoga at the flower farm, where you get to do yoga and then pick a bouquet to take home with you. So. Watch for that. I also um, am going to start teaching other yoga teachers in a 200 um, RYT teacher training. So if you've ever been interested in doing yoga um, or learning yoga or becoming a yoga teacher, reach out to me, ask me all the questions um, I can answer. It's been one of the best, um, gosh, it's been one of the best trainings and investments that I've ever done. It's helped my body in so many ways. So if you have questions, let me know. But I hope you all have a wonderful week and we'll talk to you soon. Bye.